Hi everyone, it is Yen here from Yen C Art. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm showing you how I did this painting. Very different for me. Abstract art indeed, but not fluid art. I stumbled over a um, an artist's channel on YouTube the other day. Her name is Inga Knack. She's from Germany. Um, she's a self-proclaimed fan of a very famous German artist called Gerhard Richter. And it definitely shows in her art and also in this one, I think. You be just be the judge of that, but I'm gonna show you how I did this. So first, I laid a base coat on an old canvas, a repurposed canvas, and um, the first one um, uh, you could still see, as you can see here, the 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 old painting through the 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 base coat. So I decided to put on an extra layer of base coat, um, in, and I decided to go for a deep dark orangey color. Um, but yeah, so just to cover up so that you wouldn't be able to see the old painting through this. So I'll just be painting this and then I'll start the whole process of um, adding layers of paint. It's a very interesting technique. I'm definitely going to use it again or do it again. Also, um, I actually managed to sell this painting immediately after I started showing it to some of my closer friends and... and uh, acquaintances and so it's already sold so that is amazing um, but yeah just uh, covering the the canvas here and um, then we'll start um, layering the, the colors I'll be showing you I'll be putting on the screen all the colors that I use um, and also I'll put that in the description uh, below I will also add a link for uh, Inga Knag, the, the, the artist that I stumbled over for her YouTube channel, please do go check her out. She's making some amazing pieces of art. Um, so basically what you do is you put your paint on a palette knife. Uh, it is not important to make it as even as I'm trying to do here. Um, that's not at all what you need to do because it's gonna it has to be put on the canvas in an uneven Way. so and then you just slide over the canvas and as you will see color will will um, attach to the canvas in different areas uh, and th this is the whole idea is that it's not supposed to be a full cover and then the more layers you put on um, the more interesting it'll be and you'll be able to see even though the base code you will be able to see that through in some places um, on on the on the final result, I really love this this um, this result, and um, I'm definitely like I said, I'm gonna do it a more. One thing now that I saw it here, one thing that you should notice is that you don't need to clean the palette knife when you put on new layers of paint, but I would definitely next time when you put on lighter paint like I just did here. Um, I would clean the palette knife in between. It's not a big deal here because it's actually the, the Amsterdam Pearl Violet that I'm using on top of a violet. So it's not no harm done. But especially if you add some lighter colors to a dark color that you don't want to mix or if you are at the risk of, of actually it turning brown, then of course, um, or muddy, then of course you need to be careful to clean it after uh, each swipe. Also, um, one thing that I'm going to try next time that I saw that Inga Knapp did was that she actually uh, dries some of the layers uh, with um, a, a hair dryer. Um, I did not do it and I think that that's probably a good idea. Again, depending on what colors it is that you're laying, layering on, on top of each other. Of course, if you use a hair dryer to, to dry the, the top part, the top layer, then um, you will not mix the colors. So yeah, that, that's another thing that I'm gonna try next time. But it's definitely, like I said, this is definitely something that I'm gonna try again. It is a very interesting technique and uh, I really love the outcome. I think that I will not be 
saying more really um, I really hope that you enjoy this do stick to the end uh, to see the final result um, hanging on some walls um, and um, yeah let me know what you think um, I'm really excited to have found this technique so um, you all have a good day and um, come back soon bye
sky Watching stars align Days of making sweet honey Melissa Lemon Balm Nights as warm as your breath On my chest so 